Hi and welcome to Add More Zest with Diamonds. My name's Rebecca and it's a purple post kind of day. So I do have a diamond painting from Diamond Art Studio UK to share with you. But first, I do have something else to share with you that I've actually unboxed already. But this is one of our zesty trays. Uh, so an Add More Zest zesty tray that you can now get in purple um, with a white stopper from Diamond Art Studio UK. Uh, so I'm very happy to partnership with them uh, and they are offering these trays in purple for you. We occasionally have done a limited edition purple uh, but Diamond Art Studio UK will be doing them in purple um, as an option for you all the time. So I'm very happy to have one of these to use myself. Uh, so yeah, there is that. I also have something else to share with you. Um, actually, yeah, let's do it now. So Diamond Art Studio have recently changed their toolkits. Now, what I do like about this company is you can choose whether you need a toolkit or not. And I always choose no because I do use my own pens and I use the likes of the Zesty tray or the Add More Zest tray and I use glue dots in my pen. So I don't need a toolkit, but they were very kind enough to give us one. This was actually when we went to the NEC um, to see them in November. They did give us one of the new toolkits to share with you. Um, and this is the first opportunity that I've had. Um, slash remembered so you can get a toolkit if you need one with your kit uh, you get the standard pen with a single placer you also get a multi-placer and a pen grip so the pen grip is handy especially when you've diamond painted for quite a while it can if anything you can just use it to change the shape of your pen so you can push it up for a bit, use it if you find that you're quite heavy resting here. You can use it to make your pen thinner or you can use it to make it thicker and a bit comfy. Uh, you do also, as I say, get a multi-placer. If you like to multi-place, you can pop that in the end. I think, oh, there is two actually. I thought there might have been. Uh, so I think that one's a seven and this one's a four. So if you fancy giving more place in a go, you get those. You also get a set of tweezers, pointy tweezers. Um, very good if you've put the wrong diamond, if put a diamond in the wrong place. They're still always handy. I have quite a few of these myself. Um, or some people do like to place the diamonds with tweezers. You also get a pot of wax, of the nice blue wax and you get one of the nice bigger white trays with the spout um so yeah all in this gorgeous little purple bag so if you do need a toolkit this is what you'll get i just say i always choose to not get a toolkit because i like to use the likes of the zesty or the bigger add more zest trays in various colors with many of my pretty pretty pens that i have far too many of but I am not going to apologise for. So, without further ado, let's have a look. In fact, I'm not untying the bow. I'm, I'm going to open the paper carefully down here uh, and slide out, if it will let me slide out, um, the diamond painting for today. Gorgeously wrapped in the brown paper. And I really don't, it's trying to get hold of it on this end to pull it out this end. Let's see if I can do it that way. Is that going to work? Okay, it is ripping the paper a little bit. So let's, there we go. There we go. I'm in. I'm in. Uh, this is one of their gorgeous paintings by Scott Christianson. Christian. Christianson. I'm trying to say that right it's so hard you look at it and you just keep thinking i'm saying it wrong i'm saying it wrong um but yes this is a painting that we absolutely fell in love with and um, not sure who's doing this one yet megan or me 
but to show you this is the painting so it's called glow it has 44 different colors and this is one of their new sticker sheets so when you do get it uh, if you need to flatten it down pop it down the other way up and then flatten it down because these stickers are individually cut for you so you have the symbol as one and the number as another the tweezers are very good for getting those off as well um, and if you just start bending it like this you might start losing stickers so it's always better to place it down on a surface and just try and curl up your edges and it will they will go flatter over time um, you can store them with your diamond painting rolled up or turn them upside down pop something on the top of them and they will flatten down and you can store them like this as a reference to which ones you've got and then you've got your stickers for when you kit up anyway let's look at this painting because this is stunning so we have 44 different colors in this painting it is a 40 by 90 so it's a nice long painting but not too wide. So I would work on this painting on its side. I would pro, ooh, see, when I think which side I'd start, part of me was thinking, oh, we've got these gorgeous rocks here. So I'd start this side, but then we have this gorgeous wave here. So I don't know if I'd start this. No, I think I'd still start this side. Um, you can turn your case on its side as much as you can turn the diamond painting on its side. So I would kit up the diamonds and then I would have my case facing the same way that my diamonds do. Um, and then I would work on it like this, um, working its way up, rolling it outwards once I've got diamonds on it um, and just letting this roll whichever way it wants to. But that's just my personal preference because I work on a smaller table. I want to work on the small. But if you have a nice long table, this could be really, really nice to work at on going across. It's got some nice patches. I wouldn't even say they're big patches of blockiness. Um, it's definitely not a, a very blocky painting, but it's also not hugely confetti. So you do have sections that are, are bigger blocks. That's probably one of your biggest. Uh, but then you have sections here. These are the sections I like. So if you see this dot symbol, I like these because you can tip a lot of diamonds into your tray and do quite a bit of placing diamonds. Uh, but they're nice and different different lengths, different places, and it's a mixture of multi-placing and not, um, rather than feeling you're doing the same thing all the time. And then the same with the number three. So again, you've got some nice long parts, you can multi-place if you want, but then you've got some little scatterings where it merges into the next color. But yeah, uh, 40 by 90 is the true size, so it is 90 across. 40 high this would look gorgeous above a bed or a couch and look at those colors absolutely beautiful so we've got some gorgeous pops of blue as well as these purples blues these corally and pinky colors as well absolutely love the sky and even all the tones on the beach and the waves i mean look at how those waves come out they look like waves. it always amazes me sometimes how rendering is done um got some really nice deep purples which you might not think would suit on this painting but believe me it does it's what helps bring it to life uh, i've got some more gorgeous purples that teal in there as well and some nice hot pinks bring in a little bit more jazz to that sunset and of course your blues which actually isn't as many blue diamonds as you may think because when you look at this this has actually got quite a few pinks and purples in to help bring that sun reflection 
onto here. Uh, it's an absolutely gorgeous picture. This one is say 40 by 90. It's available in square. And this one is £42.90. Um, if you add a zesty tray, you pay the same price that you would um, from our store. It's uh, when you order it with a diamond painting. If you order it on its own, then there is postage to pay with it. Um, but you do get free postage if you order uh, with a painting. I think that's in the UK. Um, you can, let's have a look what's shipping outside the UK. Um, so yeah, free shipping in the UK. Um, the charge for the tray uh, is a little bit dearer if you just buy the tray in the UK because that helps towards the cost of just shipping the tray. However, if you order it with a diamond painting kit, then you get it cheaper. Um, for the rest of the world, there is a flat rate shipping charge that they order regardless of the quantity or size of your order. So yes, there is a shipping charge for outside the UK, but it is a flat rate. So get your wish list well and truly ready um, and make use of that to get your goodies. But make sure this one is on your list. So all the details are on their website. I'm more up to date with our own shipping at prices than I am with theirs but it is free shipping in the UK and flat rate shipping worldwide depending on where you are. Uh, they have some absolutely stunning pieces uh, by many different licensed artists including this one. I guess I need to check with Megan whether this is one she's doing or whether I am. Maybe it'll be one that will end up in the decision wheel and it could be mine or hers. We shall see. Uh, but yeah, this painting is called Glow and I will pop a link to it down below. Don't forget to use my code that is also detailed down below to get yourself an extra 10% off. Um, and that is a 10% off normal price. If they have any, any other type of sale uh, that may be better than 10%, then use that instead. But thank you all so much for watching and I'll speak to you all again soon.